Welcome back. Okay, you want to continue on your pick, rant? I couldn't pick an intro. <laughs> yeah, basically, if you don't like mushrooms, you're a shit pal. You can't function as an adult. That's that's my full assessment on that. Well, I think the <sighs> there's a, there's adults, grown ass people who go to Web Robins and get like a chicken tender thing or something like the equivalent. Yeah. Any any restaurant they go out to, they get chicken tenders. I just feel like that's not acceptable. How how old do you have to be to stop getting chicken tenders at that Oh, I guess all of them. Uh, at all guard? Do they have chicken tenders at all of them? They might for like kids. Yeah. Probably twelve. I think that's usually about for all of garden. For all of <laughs> really no, for all of garden. How about for like Applebee's? Because there's like with Applebee's, you have like they have like the you know quote unquote gourmet chicken tenders where it's like a meal. Yeah. Or they have like you put sauce on it and shit. And shit. But for that, it's like, still from my car. It's the same chicken tender that you get for the kids' chicken tender. It's like you know, it's slightly fancy. Slightly fancy. Has an has an extra flavor. It's not just chicken. It's just not fried chicken. Yeah. Nothing else. And then you get some ketchup on it. And you put something on the ketchup. Dump the ketchup in. Yeah. Ketchup shouldn't go on things. Ketchup? I genuinely think that ketchup is just like a fucking uh, travesty uh, sauce. I mean, I don't mind it with like the fries, burgers, and hot dogs. But other than that, I don't really care for ketchup on stuff. Like, I don't like ketchup on my eggs. Some ketchup, people, really people put ketchup in their scrambled eggs. It's like a substitute for like having actual flavor in it. Like, it's a substitute for it being like actually good. That's why I've always seen it as. Because you put ketchup on shit where it's like, okay, we boil some hot dogs. <laughs> Time to put ketchup on it so I don't taste the shit. So there's actually like a flavor here. Yeah. Or, uh, we, uh,. Uh, I usually, for hot dogs, I'll usually put ketchup and, like, mustard, and if I'm getting, like, fancier, put some onions or something on it. Yeah, well, I don't like hot dogs. <laughs> no, I, don't like, I don't like hot dogs. Hot dogs are not something I eat. Yeah. Like, Which, like, I mean, is fair. Like, I have hot dogs, I'd rather have, like, a raw, like, even raw. Yeah. I actually just had brats for lunch. Pretty good. Yeah. Love brats. And then you get... The brats can be anything you want a But if you can't put ketchup on a brat, you put your ketchup on your brat. I didn't put ketchup on this brat, so... Yeah. yeah. So, fucking, you don't put ketchup on a brat. Brats, I put nothing. You put mustard, mustard, <laughs> barbecue sauce, and onions. <laughs> and then barbecue sauce is literally just ketchup with like brown sugar mixed in. <laughs> Not much better. You're asking me. How do you make ketchup? Like, um, what is it? Tomatoes, salt, vinegar. Vinegar. Mix it up in a bowl. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's not like you can just mix it up in a bowl. Pretty much. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Venom off is disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> It's gross. Ew. Well, he is betraying a gnat. Yeah, but even gnats are like, like too small to tell. They're disgusting. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Not a big thing of that. You should get one. Uh, no. I... I'm pretty sure... Yeah, I have... I think I have all the Pokemon that I plan on catching for the rest of the game. What, seven? Yeah. <laughs> and honestly, only four of them I really use. Yeah. <sighs> I say that not including certain four certain Pokemon that I plan on catching at the very end of the game. 
So, I have the four that I'm going to be using for the majority of the game at this point. Oh boy, another rat attack. Do you have the option uh, to bring the top of Manny's Mustard or Cat Shop or the thing? Probably ketchup, just because I can tolerate that. I don't think I would be able to do a cup of mayonnaise or mustard. I would do mayonnaise. Mayonnaise? I would throw up afterwards, <laughs> but it would be like, it's mayonnaise. Like that shit, like, peanut butter. <laughs> uh, I never really cared for mayonnaise. Mustard... I don't mind, like, with hot dogs, but I don't really want to eat that straight. <laughs> Ketchup I don't really want to eat straight either, but if given the... If I had to, between three, it would probably be ketchup. You ever, you ever do gravy shots at, uh, Grey <laughs> Queen? Yeah. That's from gravy shots, you forget you. Oh. It's not like Okay, it was like is actually is actually your I brother didn't... gets the gets gets whatever with gravy. He has not eat the gravy, so it's like wash it and just a gravy shot. <laughs> yeah, and you have heartburn and you feel sick all day. <laughs> you just incapacitate you just incapacitate yourself for an entire twenty four hours. And that was it. <laughs> really, it really sucks sometimes. You know, being the smartest man. Big burden. Yeah, sounds like you. Smartest man alive. Uh, more yeah. of the second part. Or the I've been burdened by my burden by my intelligence. <laughs> yes. The, I, I sure am. The large uh, frontal lobe. Yeah, I have a large frontal lobe. I'm like, you know, Mike Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> kind of bullies out sometimes. I hit my head. I don't have I don't have full facial awareness. So there it is. Took a lot of hits to the head. Yeah. Back in the day. We can have, they couldn't find a football album that fit me. It was too awkward. It was too oddball ob and shaped. Yeah. But I didn't wear a helmet. <laughs> it's okay, you're right. I look like the fucking pinhead people in the pinhead movie. <laughs> it's fucking Patrick and like Larry. It's okay, you're uh. Your increased intelligence allows you to use telekinet, telekinesis to move everyone out of your way. No, I'm not smart enough to convince everybody that I have telekinesis. <laughs> yeah, I don't know that. I don't know that one. I don't know either. Or just, you know, talking random crap. More or less. Yeah, but, you know, there's not enough, not, not, not much. Not much has happened in Pokemon. Yeah, and the next couple episodes are mainly just going to be trekking around, trying to... I'll tell them that. It's good. <laughs> yeah, it's good. Episodes 28 to 39. It's just a lot of... Just a lot of this. <laughs> we got to kill a lot of Sandshrew. Yeah. yeah what if there, I, I always imagine that just like... So it's just a guy who's out like fucking like bashing scenes for his balls or just like pike. And it's just like going around collecting like pelts. And he's just got he's just wandering around in, like the mountains. And he's just like kind of like hiker Joe was like, Yep, I caught me some sand shrew tonight and then this guy is guy's like, Yeah I did and he's just got like all these like all these sand shrew pelts just, like wrapped around him. And he's just like well, what are sand shrew James sand shrew rats made out of? Sand, like leather. So that is like, you know, I imagine it's like a leathery like skin. Okay. Like armadillo. Like armadillo. Like armadillo. All so right. he's going around collecting these things, <laughs> and like the hiker puts him up like, Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> this guy's going way too overboard. <laughs> what, what, not all, not into it. Yeah. Right, Skull Kraken's at level 19. People eat Pokemon. I'm pretty sure we've had this uh, 
conversation. Where they have like a Taurus program. You know? Yeah. Um, what do you think Judy tastes like? This is like the third time we've had this conversation. You mean he cannot be <laughs> made out of rock. He just can't be like completely made out of rock. He has organic eyes. He has flesh on him. Yes, he definitely does. I would agree to that. But then the next thing is... Is it all organs in there? Or does he have like actual... He can't have like muscle in like, his arms. Yeah. Like, blood vessels and shit. The beating arm. Or to have to pump blood so he can get uh, and get his punches. I would imagine he'd be very much the crap at the station. Okay. He'd have very little move. Maybe he'd pop open like an oyster and all his like shit's just like wrapped up for a guy. You know? Yeah. It'd be a big it'd be like a big like MVP. Because yeah. he already established that he probably has a small skeletal structure. Yeah, he probably has some type of skeletal structure. He's not an exoskeleton, he just like shit that he use. Yeah. Oh. Oh. He's from the. Well, like my key is out. I'm just pissed them out of my car, drinking my tea from my car. <laughs> so it has been a long weekend. More or less. Yeah. Didn't too many gravy shots. I only had three gravy shots last <laughs> night, so I'll have you now. Wow, that's pretty good for you. Getting better. You stop taking 20 to 15 brave shots on a <laughs> uh, Saturday. You... <gasps> so oh, crack is a monumental occasion. What's it going to be? I bet it's Squirtle. Yep. It's cold crack and he falls into the air. You just fucking win now. He says, is there is a reward for everything else? Oh, uh, according to can bite. He got him. He <laughs> got him. He got him. I'm going to use two TMs that I've gotten. One is Bubble Beam, and one is Water Gun. Yeah. yeah. So, now Gyarados yeah. actually knows some water type moves. Yeah. And can actually uh, so learn can some, give him some shit. So, yeah, you gotta stock that. Now you have a full working soldier ready to go. Yep. Or you can the Pokemon War too. And now I'm going to head back and get that item that I can pick up earlier. Probably so here's a little be disappointed. Here's a little more question. Okay. So I always, I always assumed that I always thought that the trainers, like the gym leaders, yes. they're both they're the best like trainers around. Right? <laughs> so that always made me assume that they they had like a like you know like a chat like a team for the gym. Maybe they have like a real team somewhere else. Oh, like, like that's like they're they're like they're strong, real strong Pokemon that are like high level. Yeah, and then you had like they have like their shit that's like ready for like scaling at the gym. Yes. Now, to the Elite Four, the Elite Four, do they just are those there? Is that their team? I would. Uh... I don't know, because the Elite Four is based off type as well. It's not... Each Elite Four has a group of Pokémon situated for that type, mm -hmm. selected for that type. And then the Champion is the only one that has, like, a whole array of, team, of a team. Yeah, but there's the... Uh... The champion still only has like level 60 stuff. Yeah. So you think that over time, I believe you can get Pokemon stronger than level 60. Assuming that many 
assuming people even, you know, make it there. It's... No, but in general, even, but like, in general, like, the first guy always gets a really fast, so he's going to get a small fucking guy. Yeah. So, you think they just, maybe they just have, like, a static team that they always, like, use, but it's wrong with anybody, so, how does it all work? Pokemon's fucking stupid. <laughs> also, you can definitely, like, fucking kill anything if you have a level 100 like this, because nobody would have level 100 like anything yeah. in the game. So you can just pretty much just, like, start killing people, like, in the streets, like, straight up, like, okay, you just do it. Wait the fucking thing. <laughs> like, no one can do anything. You can start taking out gym leaders, like, in the or. Yeah. Start going for for government for government leaders. Getting real serious here. Well, they want to find me. They want to find me. Um, <laughs> they won't find me. I know a little in this phone. They know my name. They know who I am. Oh, they know your first name. They gave me a suit. It's a fake name. <laughs> fake name. You're gonna try it, I think. There's the shit. I sold a useless nugget for $5,000. Yeah. Thanks, dick. <laughs> Alright. Yeah. With that, we'll see you guys next time.